This video will show us how to add categories. To begin, we will click on Category Wizard. In Category Wizard, we'll look for Manage Categories. Here in Manage Categories, we can add, edit, or delete our categories. I'll start by adding a category. And we'll name it Food. This override tax default, especially in food, refers to if this category has a different tax than your regular categories or your regular products. So if a food item is charging less tax, we'll hit the override tax default and click on the new one. This will allow for only this category to be charged 3% tax instead of the regular 7% that I have selected on mine and click OK and we've added it. I'll add another one without the override tax button. Kitchen items. There we have our two categories. If we need to delete, we just select the category and click on delete. And yes. There are our two food categories, our category, food, and our kitchen category. Once our categories are added, we can select a category from the drop-down menu and then place our products in that category. In this example, we only have two items. When you have more, you can use the filters, whether it's by vendor, product code, description, item number, or price. Once we find our product that we want to put on the food item, we select it and hit select. This will drop down in the bottom and place this product under that food category. Once we're finished, we will just add to category. It lets us know if we're sure we want to add to category. Yes to continue and that item would already be selected on the food category. We'll do another quick example with kitchen and we'll place the other product in that category. 